Elizabeth Cady Stanton was one of the chief organizers of the 1848 Seneca Falls Convention, the first convention in the United States dedicated exclusively to women's rights. She also wrote the Declaration of Sentiments, the seminal document of the women's movement that set the agenda for the movement for years to come. Like so many other women's rights activists of her era, she first became involved in the abolitionist movement. Stanton attended the 1840 World Anti-Slavery Convention in London, where she met Lucretia Mott. The two decided to organize a women's rights convention in the United States in part because they had been barred from fully participating in the London Convention, being relegated to simply watch the proceedings on account of their gender. Over the years, Stanton collaborated with Susan B. Anthony, and the pair wrote prolifically, making a lasting impact on the women's movement. Both Stanton and Anthony advocated for extending the right to vote to women with the 15th Amendment, and were disappointed when it did not. In response, they formed the National Women's Suffrage Association in 1869. Elizabeth Cady Stanton is remembered for her persuasive oratorical skills, the power of her writing, her tireless advocacy of the right to vote for women, and reform of laws that kept men and women on an unequal footing. This has been 60 Second Civics, a podcast of the Center for Civic Education. I'm Mark Gage. 